if you become willing to grow, a real sincere willingness, sincerity, being in integrity with your soul, you're willing to become more yourself, then the universe works out the details, providing everything necessary for you to take your next step. Where there's willfulness, there's a wall. Where there's willingness, there's a way. And so as we're maturing on our spiritual path, we become more willing, more pliable, more open. We will the will of God to be done in our life, which means we're willing for a greater expression of life to happen. People discuss ages and ages and ages what the will of God is, and I'm here to tell you it's very simple. The will of God is for a greater expression of life, love, beauty, and the extension of all the God qualities. That's the will of God. So when you become willing to embrace the vision for your life, you become willing to grow. You become willing to embrace what you have, not take it for granted. You become willing to let go. You enter into a state of vibrational willingness, then you're no longer inhibiting the flow of the presence of God through all of its instruments to cycle you up into a higher states of, of consciousness and well-being. And so this, this final process today is one around willingness. It's one around activating our sacred yes, our divine and sacred yes. And so once again, with the sweet silence around the wonderful notes via Ray Davis, we turn within. And we give thanks for whatever willingness we have in our heart right now. And we scan our awareness and we remember moments in our life where we simply became willing to try a new thing. We became willing to grow, we became willing to go for something, we became willing to extend ourselves and not knowing what was gonna happen, whether it was gonna work or but we know the feeling tone and the vibrational frequency of willingness. We know the vibrational frequency of yes, the sacred yes, the yes to God, the yes to intelligence, the yes to excellence. And we know encapsulated in the yes is a no. Once you say yes, really, then you're also saying no. No to mediocrity, no to excuses, no to apathy, no to lethargy, slovenly. You're saying no to something the moment you say yes to life. And so with your outer eye closed, the inner eye open, feel into the frequency of, of willingness. Remember how that feels, I'm willing. I'm willing. I don't know how I'm gonna do it, but I'm willing. I'm willing. Feel into the vibration of sacred yes. Yes, I am. Yes, I can. Yes, I'm willing. Say with those here in the sanctuary, yes, I am. Yes, I can. Yes, I am willing. Now, in that vibrational frequency, we once again allow it to amplify willingness. We once again allow it to amplify willingness. Yes, willingness. Yes to life. Willingness. Yes. Deeply inhale, suspend the breath. When you hear this clap of my hand, amplify willingness 100 fold, and then breathe out. <sighs> Feel the frequency of willingness. Oh, I'm so willing to be my best self and to be governed by the angels of my higher nature. I'm so willing to embrace the gifts and talents within me and to express them fully and completely. I'm so willing to let go of anything that no longer serves me. I'm willing, I'm willing to embrace the edge of my own growth. I'm willing to be captured and pulled by a vision that I'm learning to articulate a little bit more and a little bit better every day. I'm willing. Feel into the willingness, feel into the willingness, feel into the willingness. And in this dynamic of willingness, 
I speak the word for each of us, knowing that there's only one of us here, one ocean, many waves, one presence, many infinite expressions of the presence. I speak the word for each and every one of us with a deep sense of gratitude and the thanksgiving and appreciation for my life, for the life of God operating and acting and expressing through me and through we. Grateful. And in this consciousness of gratitude and thanksgiving and pure appreciation, I set something in motion by the power of the word, the, the logos, the vibration, the frequency of the word that I am speaking is for each and every one of us that we may be free from any lack, any limitation, any restriction, any hindrance, that we may step up to the vibrational plate and let God be God as our life. That health-wise, every organ action function of our body temple is made new. Our mental body, absolutely clear. Our emotional body, totally pure. The body of our affairs reflects and reveals the sacred order, sacred geometry, the sacred order of the universe, an order, an elegance, and a beauty. And everything is working together for our individual and for our collective good. Feel into that right now where your vision is concerned where your embodiment of your next stage of unfoldment is concerned, where you're letting go. You're having and being. Oh, feel that you have everything you need right now. It's, it's, not a, it's not against the law to feel that you have everything you need. It's the right use of the law to feel it. So in this consciousness, we also embrace Peggy Zimmerman. Right where she is, God is, we embrace Cassandra. Morello for her mother, Patricia. John Majors for his nephew Charles, and we continue to embrace Richard Knapp for his wife Vicki, who made the transition, and Peggy Zimmerman's friend Karen Kahan, who made the transition from the visible to our sensorium to the invisible, only seeing with the divine eye. So in this moment of great consciousness and great love and great setting in motion and embracing a vision, as we begin this year together, we bless Agape International Spiritual Center as a divine and perfect spiritual idea held in the mind of the infinite that has everything it needs for its own unfoldment, its own evolution, its own capacity to be in service to thousands and thousands and thousands and millions of people on this planet. Everything is working together for our individual and collective good so that we continue to rise to the next level of consciousness as a community making a mighty difference on the planet at this time in human history and beyond. We bless agape. It has what it needs now, when? It's happening right now. The eternal is perennial. It's only in the now. Right now, all needs are met for agape. It's constituents, it's family, love streamers. All is well. And for this, and more than words can ever, ever articulate, convey, we let it be. If you're in vibrational harmony, simply say, and so it is. Even if you're live streaming, say, and so we are. And so I am. Amen. Amen.